Good evening, folks. Crazy Anthony here again. Welcome to my crazy channel. How are you people out there? Are you okay? I hope you all are well and safe, especially now in this crazy time with the COVID-19. I know you guys are worried about your family members. I know there will be some people out there that are really struggling with their finances, finances at the moment. Folks, my prayers are with you. May our Heavenly Father shine His light over you and grant you all the wishes you wish for. In any case, enough of my chit chat. This morning I wake up in such a beautiful mood. So refreshed. Had some wacky, weird dreams. <laughs> I'm not telling you about it. But in any case, a couple of months ago, Standard Bank approached me and told me, Sir, you qualify for a credit card. Now listen to the words, you qualify for a credit card. Not, you may be qualify, you possibly qualify, you qualify for a credit card. I thought to myself, I said, you know, there's too many scammers out there, and uh, some are rather going to play it safe. And I said to him, well, let, I'll get back to you guys. So I drove through to the Standard Bank and I asked him about this story. And apparently there is a, a, a department in the branches that actually handle things like that, that phone clients and tell them they've got credit cards and whatever, whatever. So I thought to myself, you know what, okay, I'm not going to bother with it now, don't need a card, I'm financially stable, everything is going well, so let's just leave it. In any case, this morning, I, like I said, I woke up in such a great mood, thought nothing in the world can destroy it, nothing. Yeah, sure. Standard Bank phones me this morning. Congratulations, sir. You qualify for a credit card. Again, you qualify for a credit card. Great stuff. I felt, oh man, this is fantastic. Due to the fact that I went to the bank and they told me it's not a scam and all that, I thought to myself, wow. You know? My car needs new tires, and needs a good service. And I've got a couple of things around the house I need to sort out. The finances are not strong enough for me to actually attempt these things. But now I'm getting a credit card. I can sort out these things. Man, it's like a prayer, be on, a prayer being answered. Fantastic. So I thought. The lady started asking me questions like, how much money do I earn per month? Why would you ask me that? You've got my banking details in front of you. You just said I qualified for a credit card. Why would you need to know how much I'm earning per month? But I answered. Then she asked me, where am I employed? I'm like, hello? This information is also in my account. It should be open in front of you. But I kept on answering. She asked me a whole bunch of questions and I just kept on answering. And when she had came to a point where she turned around and said to me, Sir, you do not qualify for a credit card. I'm like, hello? You just told me I qualify for a credit card. How does this work? And she says, hold on, sir. I'm going to get someone else to help you. I'm like, excuse me, lady. I don't need to talk to someone else. You said I qualify for a credit card. I want my credit card. In any case, I'll hold on for a couple of minutes, listening to a whole bunch of noise on a phone. Another lady comes to the phone and says, Sorry, sir, but you do not qualify for a credit card. I said, excuse me, lady. The other lady said, I do qualify for a credit card. Now you tell me I don't. She says, no, it was a mistake. She was meant to say, you qualified to apply for a credit card. Excuse me? The whole world qualifies to apply for a credit card. Doesn't mean they're going to get it. You said, I qualify for a credit card. Her words was, sir, you qualify for a credit card. After a while of complaining about it, she just chucked the phone down in my ear. 
I mean, really? How professional is that? So listen to me, folks. If Standard Bank phones you and tells you you qualify for a credit card, just put the phone down. They're wasting your time, the little precious time that you have. You could be speaking to our Father in Heaven, or you could be speaking to your family, or you could be working. Don't waste your time listening. If it's Standard Bank, you answer the phone and they say, Hi, we're Standard Bank. You just put the phone down. Because they just want to waste your time. Well, enough of my chit chat. Please remember to subscribe to my channel. I would really love to hear what you people think about this. Please leave your comments, even if it's evil or not. I'd love to hear about you guys out there. May our Father in Heaven bless you and protect you guys. Peace. This is Crazy Anthony. I'm out of here.